What's going on, everybody? If you didn't know, now you know your boy Kelvin here back again on this Uncharted 3 action. And I don't think I've brought this uh, gameplay from Uncharted 3 since the beta in like June or July. I think it was June that the beta was out. So this is my first game on Uncharted. Well, not my first game. But my first gameplay that I'm throwing up from the full game. And I've had this game since like a couple days after it came out and look at me get beasted on but look at that i got a two-piece with that grenade that i threw after i died so it was all right but yeah like i was saying um i've had uncharted 3 since like a couple days after it came out i had stopped by walmart to get some other stuff but me you know i saw the uncharted 3 system and i saw uncharted 3 was out and i just i just couldn't resist buying this game because i had so much fun playing the beta the multiplayer i loved it but sad, sadly i really haven't played this game that much due to battlefield 3 and 2k 12 you know i just got so many other games that i'm playing that this game pretty much got put on the back burner so i, I really haven't played it much although i did beat the story the story was this this campaign in this game Probably one of the best story modes that I've storylines. I mean that I have played in a long time Like it is action-packed. It's cinematic like it's amazing. I remember The uncharted 2 commercial where the guy was like yo my girlfriend She thinks this is a movie like I can I understand now like it's it's that amazing It's it's sick now. I never I, I have uncharted 2. I bought it after I played the uncharted 3 demo I mean beta in June because I loved it that much so I picked up Uncharted 2 I haven't beat the story yet for Uncharted 2 I'll probably beat that uh, later on when I get bored with my other games but like yo this game it's amazing I love it so much the multiplayer though it's it's another story the multiplayer is probably one of the hardest shooting games I've ever played it is so so difficult and it's not it's not like the third person aspect that gets me it's just like uh, I don't know what to say it's just difficult and the, the players on the other team the people who play this game definitely do not make it easy on you the, the people who play this game are straight beasts like this is probably the only shooting game that they have to tell you the truth because they are such high levels everybody who plays this game is a high level and they just straight up beast on you and so it's, it's it's definitely difficult if you don't have the game by now then you're at a huge huge disadvantage everybody else knows the maps they know they know the things to do that just just ex just abuse you man straight up and they got all the better weapons this is kind of, it's kind of like call of duty and battlefield where you unlock weapons as you increase your rank so they got all the weapons, they got all the perks, they got everything on their side. If you don't have this game by now, you probably don't want to pick this up straight up. But, me, I definitely love it. It's it's a challenge, you know, it's a challenge for me. That's why I started playing it, because Battlefield 3, I've pretty much done everything I can do, because recently I achieved boss status, I became a colonel, which is like the highest rank you can get, and then... You kind of go up to like Colonel 1, Colonel 2, Colonel 3, Colonel 4, blah, 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 and keep going like that. But, you know, once I reach Colonel, I'm like, yo, I've pretty much done what I've had to do. I've achieved the highest rank. And I said there's not much else you can do, but there actually is a lot you can do because of all the medals in the game. I've got a lot of medals, but there's a couple more I think I can get. There's a lot of medals in the game, which I know I ain't got no damn chance in getting because... It, it's just it's just hard to get a lot of these medals straight up but so yeah if you want to check out my stats on battlefield 3 annotation on the screen will take you there so you can see that your boys has been beasting on the battlefield so like i said i wanted to change it up i wanted to have a challenge because battlefield 3 honestly it's no longer really a challenge to me i'm straight beasting on everybody in every game i play i rarely go negative i'm usually top three getting those mvps but in this game it's a completely other story it is a challenge for me to even go close to positive in this game like i kid you not most games i'm going negative or i'm going like 10 and 9 like it's horrible but now as you just saw 
the other team was given a power play because they're down six. So right now they're only down five, but they were down six, which is why they got the power play. And I like that. That's a good twist to the game for me. You know, it keeps the game exciting. Like, if the other team is getting beasted on, they're getting dominated, they, they get a little bit of a chance to... Something, something just to help them so that they don't completely get beasted on, right? So, right now, it's a marked man is the power play um, where they can see one person on our team and he's marked and if they kill him, then they get two points. Or they, yeah, they get credited for two kills instead of one. So, it can help them come back and that, that marked person on our team, they know the exact location of him because, as you can see, there's no radar in this game. So... Yeah, there's no radar. I, I, I'm not even going to say nothing about that. So, yeah. So, there's no radar in this game, which I definitely like. Um, I think it makes people run around a little bit more. It's like, rarely do I ever see people camping in this game. Like, it happens every now and again because people, for some reason, they want to snipe in this game. I don't know why you would want to snipe in this game. You can, Look at this. Look at this shit I'm doing right now. You could run up walls and shit. But people want to sit, sometimes people want to sit in a corner and snipe, so... Like, when you can move around like you can in this game, you can roll around, you can jump off of things. I think it really... You don't really want to camp when you can do all these things. And you see me get that double down. So, yeah, this game right here is coming up to an end. My team really wasn't all that good. And so, I've, I've placed close to the top. I mean, we our team, we could have won if it wasn't for that power play, I think which helped them to come back but it was still a close game uh the power play kind of turned things in their tide they got a little bit of momentum they came back and they beat us but this was definitely action packed the action was always happening in this area so you would spawn you would come back right to this area and you would fight it out so definitely a, a fun game i finished 13 and 10 so this is your boy kelvin and i'm out deuces